welcome back to the edge. So, I've done some work and I'll show that off later. But first, Cora asked me to help him with a very unusual request in preparation for something that I'm not sure I want to be part of, but I'm a part of anyways because that's just how it goes. So let's run over to Cora's and we'll see what happens because this is going to be quite the adventure to say the least. You can kind of see a little bit of stuff beyond there. Shh, you don't see anything. <gasps> what? What? What is this? Water? I don't have water here. That's my head there, isn't it? Ooh. I suddenly feel great glee in what is to come. Great glee. <laughs> okay, so... Right, what's so, the plan? Now, our server uses the heads mod. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I want to test something. Okay. Will you kill me? Actually, wait. Let me. I there. appreciate the thorns Will you kill me? <laughs> yeah. Oh, that hurts. Ow. Stabby, stabby. Where, where did my grave go? It's right there. Oh, there it is. At the foot of your bed. Yep. Ooh, I got my own head. That's cool. <laughs> and a bit disconcerting that I can carry my own head around. <laughs> That's funny. Red, Red left a head for me, along with a prank to my fountains. So I now have one of my heads over by my portal. Because why not? Nice. So let me just take all this stuff out of my inventory, because I don't need it all for what I want to do. Are you trying to set up a graveyard? No. Um, I'm going to be right back. Can you wait here just for a minute? Sure. All right. To be fair, I have a pretty good idea of what's about to happen, but this is also slightly terrifying, and I'm looking forward to it. Oh dear. That is. Hello. That. Is... <laughs> a little bit disturbing. Oh uh, yeah. Yeah. Let's see. Does. That is. Um, so my the old look. player head. Stayed the same from when you'd killed me. Mm-hmm. Which means that if you change skins, it'll still be the player head from when you were killed. Yeah, should be. I need a lot of these heads. Are you asking me to kill you a lot? Yes. Okay. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> no hesitation. I mean, this sounds entertaining. Very entertaining. Because you just keep spawning. <laughs> and you're getting all these heads, right? Yes. Excellent. We, I mean, we no. We need a lot of heads. I'm just killing you for the fun of killing you. <laughs> How many of these heads do you have so far? Seven. Out of way, and I think I have some in here. There, I put what I have in there. Nice. Very nice. <laughs> I punched you back. I noticed. I punch you with my own head. That's gross. That's very gross. It was not effective. It was not effective. It's strangely squishy. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out what the what the little particles are that seem to hit off you sometimes. Uh, there shouldn't be, but there are, um, I mean, there is the ender chest right here. No, there's like a little... Ooh, I have a fun thought. Oh, something you can do. Aqua circle. You, what? Stop hitting me then! Hold on. <laughs> Wait, so you want something fun effects and all that. well no I'm, I'm saying like when I hit you there's like greenish aqua circles oh 
I have no idea why. Yeah, like, yeah, greenish aqua little circles every time I hit you. I'm pretty sure I haven't seen this for other stuff. We're at uh, 68 right now, by the way. Oh, okay, so we're good. Yep. <laughs> I thought you would. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you. I'm going to go change my skin. You're welcome. That was strangely therapeutic. Nice. So now, tomorrow, uh, red screen, I need to scope out her base actually sometime before then, figure out where, and just flood her whole area with armor stands. Yep, that ooh, sounds kind of creepy. Actually, ooh, you know what would be really fun to do? Hmm. I should totally put on an invisibility potion and a head. I want to see if it floats, just the floating head. Oh, gosh, that's terrifying. Hold on, do I have one? I do. Let's, let's try this out. Science. Oh, my word. That is... F so... Is it F5 to look at yourself? F5. Oh. <laughs> oh, man, oh, that's so creepy. I could also put on whatever armor... <laughs> um, oh, let, let's try this real quick. Hold on. Uh, well, I dare say that was an adventure now, wasn't it? So we'll see. My plan is that I'll be on in a little bit for a and we'll do some shenanigan -y stuff, I guess. I'm not even sure why I'm helping Cord, to be perfectly honest. I mean, he's he's been twisted by the lapis use. But it would be really fun to do this, so I'm going to help him in this, and yeah, we'll see how that goes. I'm torn between nervous and excited, and a little bit of both, and I'm just, I'm not sure. But hey, we're going to do the thing, and we'll see how that goes. In the meantime, let me show you some of what I've done. So you can see I finished this part of this hall. And then we come into yonder room, and I went ahead and did some scene. I still need to go my upper edges, actually. And I added some light, natural lighting here. And then I realized because we're up against the wood, I really shouldn't do lava. So, yeah, why not? And then my little pantry down here, I've added some, gotten, actually, I'm running low on food, aren't I? Um, uh, let's do some chicken when I'm out. We'll go ahead and just do that for now. Um, so we have some of this going on down here for food. I still need to figure out what exact food I want to put in there. It might be a gapple. I'm not sure yet. I think this room is done. I think I'm satisfied with leaving that as it is. So that's cool. And then I have over here my little lava farm that I've expanded a bit because I can. And now I have this lovely large furnace smelter. And when things are done, they come down here. And actually, I think I filled this up. Did I fill this up completely? Yes, I did. Good, 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 good. So as you can see, I have done all this as well. So I have an idea for my flooring, which I might start doing soon. I am very thrilled with how that has turned out right here. Um, I might change some of this around. I've not yet decided. My main concern right now, actually I could probably move that. My main concern is for, for any friends that come and visit, if they're not paying attention, they're going to run right here into the lava. I don't know if I want to do a glass block or something, but I kind of feel like I really want to avoid scribs or red or anyone running into there. I'm also thinking, when you get through, that this is a lovely hiding place for stuff. Which, actually, I can move this carpet now. So I might, at some point, maybe put some sort of hidden thing back here that only we would know about. I don't know what. But I'm thinking it'd be a really fun, fun little thing to have hidden back there, you know? But for right now, let's go get started on the uh, floor here in the hall. I, I want to try this idea. I think it's going to be a good one. Let's find out.
Oh, I am pleased. I am so ridiculously pleased. Look at this. Look at this. And like with these having grown up as high as they have. And we have the purple and the light and we have that. And I mean, oh. That, you guys, you guys, is that not, that, that is awesome. I, I absolutely love that. Ah. Oh. And that, so I have the soul soil under this here. And it's just, oh, it's, it's, it's great. I love this. Now, I do need to decide if I'm going to do anything for this kind of area where you, you know you're walking into here I have not decided on my floor yet I'm not gonna keep it as sand I promise um, I don't know if I'm gonna have anything else on the walls I I feel like leaving these big and bare and empty is not ideal I just don't know what to put on it that wouldn't seem tacky or junky so I need to figure that out I am still ridiculously pleased over that um, and I went ahead and had a bit of fun and added some some more right over there um, but I haven't done the floor over here yet. And I'm currently thinking what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and finish that all up there. And, okay, so you know my idea about the secret room thing that I was going to do over in that corner? Well, over here, I have this. This is going to come across to here. We have the wall here. I'll probably have that two, two lava stream right here, just as before. But then I realized I'm going to have this whole section back here that's going to have a wall, like be walled off. What if I do something with this more than the other spot? Like the other spot will still do something. I don't know what yet. So if you have any ideas, let me know. But this, I mean, I could have a hidden library. I could have a secret garden. I could have, I don't know what. <laughs> I mean, if I was going to do anything with like lapis or something, I could hide it back there and that could be my secret lapis chamber. No, 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 no. I'm not doing lapis. I'm not going to get into lapis. We know how bad it is. We know the corruption it causes. I'm not going to get into lapis. No, no, I'm not, I'm not. But it would be a really good room space for that. How, just, I mean, I can do five, I can do five, this, nope, nope, I'm not doing lapis, we know lapis is bad, we know lapis is bad, I apparently need to put lava in here, I could do that right now, actually, no, lapis is bad, we're not doing the lapis thing, core is already bad enough at it, with it, because of it right now, I'm not gonna, I'm not joining him in that. It'll be some other use. Some other use. And now we've done the floor on that side. I think we should do the floor on this side. But I don't think I'll do this floor actually until I have walled that section off. Which means I should probably come over back over here soon and relocate these chests of like sandstone and whatnot. And that one is sandstone and relocate all this. So that might be my next goal. And then I'm thinking I might do something. I don't know if I want to wall off under the stairs here or use it for storage of some sort. I'm not sure because I do still want to finish making this a grand entrance. But I just haven't decided how exactly. Because then it'll be, you know, you walk in, grand entrance, ha, hallways opening they'll go straight over to here and this will be its own room and then we'll section it all off and I don't know that would be quite nope 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 on we go on we go okay my dudes <laughs> so I I might have to do this or I might have to uh on that end and this end. I might have to change this up if I can. I'm trying to remember what's on the inside. Nope, nope, can't change that up. That that's a nope change. <laughs> Never mind then. I was gonna have to have a weird 
thing there, I guess, where there's no lava. <sighs> oh, that's sad. But I have this hallway. The walls here are done, and I have the ceiling part done. <sighs> so I goofed. I have been working for the last, oh goodness, four hours. <laughs> and I thought that that ceiling up above me, the birch planks, I thought that I was using birch for that side railing too. But no, no, I decided apparently, apparently, over on this hall that I already had done, on this, that's not birch. That's not birch at all! And I had literally done all this and all that and on the other side as well. <sighs> and that's not what it is. So I've gone through all here, fixing that. And now I've gotten through most of this side. And that part will be done. Hurrah. And then I still have all this. And I'm not going to do that tonight. Nope. Nope, I'm not. I want to go to bed soon. <laughs> so, I have some over here where it's, again, you can see the birch where I was thinking that's what I was doing until I realized that's not what I'm doing. And, oh, great. So, I'm not sure if I want to do, like, sandstone for that as well or keep the birch or do something different. I don't, I honestly don't know. So I need to figure that out. That might be something I'll plan and figure out later. And I'll just do the strips. My my um, my edging there. All this way. And then... Okay, I don't get this. But somehow, there seems to be sand blocks left everywhere. And I've, I haven't seen or heard a single Enderman all day. And yet, th this is the thing. But look, see how I did this lovely thing here all that all that's gonna have to get changed I have to swap out every single piece every single piece and it's gonna take forever because I have to set up all the scaffolding and blarg but I'm gonna do it anyways because I need to have it done right if a job is worth doing once it's worth doing right the first time or however that saying goes but anyhow, I have these walls, this much wallage is done, which is fantabulous, which also really helps light things up a bit. So I can kind of reduce some of my torch spam that I have going on here. Now, I don't know still how exactly I want to do this entry part. Like, so whenever, whenever the day comes that I finish this, I wanted to have this be like this grand, like you come up and it's like, oh, and I'm not sure how that's going to look yet. I'm not sure what I'm going to do. I have to admit, I'm really kind of tempted to have lava coming out of the mouths to some degree. Like that would just be rather entertaining to me, but I don't know if I want to have screaming faces inside my build right now. We'll see. This is going to bug me. I really feel like I should have another one there and another one there. But it goes on the outside where I can't and I'll have to... Mm, that, that, that bugs me. But thinking of real fast. Remember my thing about that hidey hole over my shoulder in the corner back that way? Well... There's then, I realize, this hidey hole that I mentioned earlier. Actually, earlier this episode, and I think about it. And this is just... I'm not sure what I want to put here. Do I want to have it be like a secret book room? Do I want to have this be like a super secret, super secure respawn point where this is where I can come and have a, a bed and check my light levels while I'm here um, and, and over here is where I'll have then like a, a spare bed and a secret bedroom 
that could be kind of cool, honestly. In which case, I really did fix that roof. Um, I don't know, but like, especially having this and this, like, it's. I want to do something, and I don't know what. I have no idea what it would look like. I have no idea if I want to do something like a hidden secret treasure room away from other people. Or if it be this spare room for myself so I have this, like, a completely safe spawn point where no one's going to know where I am and it's going to be completely safe from them. I don't know. So, if you have any ideas that you can think of, let me know. Oh, I don't want to travel up the lava. Oh, that's fun too. <laughs> And with that, I emerge from there. This looks so much better changing that out. It's just going to be annoying because I have to swap it out everywhere else. But that's okay. We're going to do the job, and we're going to do the job well. And that's just part of life. Sometimes we make mistakes, and we have to do it over and over again. Which, then we have to try to not complain all the horribleness because, ugh, I should have been paying attention. I just lost scaffolding in my lava. Such is life as well when you live in a fiery zone. I can't complain that one. That was completely self-inflicted because <laughs> I have all my lava up. It's just how it's going to be. But all that to say, I am really pleased with how this is turning out. Like, I am so excited. Guys, I hope you like it too. I, I'm loving the way the space is already starting to come out. Like, there's so much to do. I don't know what all I'm going to do with half of this anyways. I don't know what I'm going to do with this room, back or my shoulder, and all that stuff. I have no idea. If you have ideas, I'll take them. But I'm excited, and it's just, this has been a really fun way to relax. And so, yeah, I, I am grateful to have a active server right now. It's... It's a real blessing to have an active server because I've been on other servers where after a while people start dwindling here and there and it gets lonely and sad and quiet. And we haven't had that yet. And I'm grateful for that. So thank you for joining me today. This is a slightly shorter episode, I know, except for all my rambling. But... I feel like this has also been a productive episode, and the prankage I was talking about with Kor. Make no mention of this to anyone. Say nothing. We will wait and see when it happens. I know we're talking about doing it tomorrow. It might not be tomorrow, and we want to keep it a secret. Can you keep a secret? Please keep a secret. And if you think of it, if you haven't already, subscribe, like the video if you want to. That'd be pretty cool. And I'll see you next time. <laughs>